Hey, what's up, y'all? This is us coming to you with another video, another vlog just for you. Alongside, I have uh, my partner, friend, sister. I have Asia Sensual Brown. And D, what's up, y'all? And this is me, your boy, Cameron Killer Berry. And this vlog session is a continuous topic that we've been doing for a couple of months now. We just figured we'll do it on this snowy, cloudy ass day because Mother Nature's been on her period and she's just coming all over the place. She's just been, you know, angry at everybody. And I said earlier, I just want to drive my dick right up that surface just so I can get her <laughs> functioning properly. She needs to feel a man. Spring just needs to get here fast because <laughs> I'm, I'm tired of this shit. I'm tired of it. I don't know what to walk outside with. Sometimes I walk out with some Tams, low socks, khaki shorts, a flight jacket, white beater. <laughs> it's like I'd be uncoordinated as hell. I just don't know what the Mother hell Nature's wear. bipolar. Okay, yeah. she's really bipolar. I can't deal with her. Yeah, I can't deal with. I don't her. know what to do. I, I'm I'm all over the place. I don't know. But this uh, vlog coming to y'all today, we basically is doing sex education part three. Three. We pretty much went over all the basics, like the first one and the second one. We was talking about, you know, the safety of it all and doing this. By this time, you all should be knowing what to do properly. Now we can tell you all about the dirty stuff you can be doing with sex. Doing it properly, because that's what the first one was for. Indeed. Properly. The proper way. Wait a minute. <laughs> Gotta pop it. Just I drank a choice today. Black. I got yeah. the fruit punch. I got the watermelon. Sensual has watermelon. Yeah. Indeed. Cheers. Indeed. He's a scarfer. Mm. I take my time away because I'm a lady. But. <coughs> yeah, the first one was just about doing it the right way. You know, being safe with it all. And, you know, what you're doing now, we're going to tell you about the dirty, kinky stuff. You get to the doing. fun stuff. The fun part. Oh, oh. Alright, it's just like, uh, how many of y'all look at porn when you actually are having sex? Like when you actually having sex? Yeah, when you're having the sex. Do you look at porn? Not while I'm having sex, but I look Why at is it, it that you don't look at it? Why don't you answer questions instead of us asking them questions? Why don't you answer them? I, well, I personally don't look at it while I'm having sex, but I do look at it. You know, Why? just give me an idea. Would you ever do it? While I'm having sex, yes. Why haven't you yet? I don't know. I haven't thought about it. You know, I'm too, I don't know. I, I'm too in the know. moment, I guess. Too in the moment. Too in the I moment. I feel that. I don't think about porn. I just do the damn thing. Just do the damn thing. What I about you? Like me? Oh yeah, I look at porn all the time when I'm doing it. You know, <laughs> I'm doing it in my head when I'm sleeping. When I'm, <laughs> when I'm eating breakfast. When I'm talking to my mom. <laughs> when I'm talking to my dad, you know, kind of sex is kind of pretty much always on my mind. It's just I know how to control it when it comes to this, you know, this rod roddy pipe. I know what to do to control this wrestler in my pants. Under my briefs, under my boxers. The wrestler is contained. He's rated PG. <laughs> Attitude error is over. Oh, so God, now he drink. knows, now he knows <laughs> how to, you know, do things the proper way I instead mean, of just going all around and surfacing that pipe all around. Good thing I have a drink right now. <laughs> surfacing that pipe. That pipe. But yeah, I look, I look at uh, porn like all the time. Shit. Maybe a human I, being, I could be you sitting, look at porn. I could be sitting with a friend or whatever. They'll just walk in the room and say, hey Cam, what you doing, man? Shit, sitting right here looking at this um, double penetration porn <laughs> on the X video. Double penetration. Double penetration porn star starring Sasha Gray and... Uh, Julie, Julie, Julie Marriott or something. Like I, na I just named their names and everything. They said, "Oh shit, I was, did I disturb you?" No, I didn't. Like I was doing no B fest or nothing like that. I was just, you know, I was just watching it. Like I just look at porn. It's just I'm a human. I look at porn. Sometimes That's what I porn do. give you, you know, new ideas. I look at porn. I mean, you have to switch it up in the bedroom. I look at porn. I look at porn. Well, like I was saying, sometimes porn give you ideas to, you know, switch it up in the bedroom. Right. You're absolutely right. And let me tell you something. I forgot what I was going to say. We'll get it together. <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's, it's 
What is your favorite position that you essentially bring up? Remember, like you said in the beginning, you're a lady. I so like doggy style. I like doggy style. That's not lady like. You can't say that on sex education. Who says right? I had to be a lady in the bedroom, though? You're right. <laughs> you're absolutely right. This is the first time I shut up and I shut up. <laughs> I ain't got to be a lady in the bedroom. <laughs> I'm lady no, street in the freaking bed, shut okay? Up like, shut up, Heather. That was a very, very honest answer. Indeed. What did I just ask? What's my favorite uh, style of uh, position? Oh, yeah. Oh. What's your favorite position? My favorite position would be on the wall. On the wall. I like on the wall. I just like hearing that clash. Because the wall is just such a misunderstood figure in our life. It's quiet, just like a human being. A wall sits there, but it's always have a, it. A wall always have our back, and just like you it has that woman's right. back when you're pushing them against it. When you just <laughs> going just like that, and you push them against it, and the wall, it just it starts talking when it's exactly right. I have to hang on to the wall in order to, you know. Then we, we start doing some some wounded stuff for him. We gonna start doing it. Coming to coming to the America. That's my movie. We was looking at that before we did this, and we're drinking while we're doing this, and uh, that's what we do. So guys, uh, we're gonna ask you questions, even though you can't answer them right now. But uh, my question is going to be: Is what is your favorite position? What is it that you like doing best in bed? What are you good at? That's my question for you. What's your question? We pretty much summed it up right there. <laughs> That's all? Yeah. I got nothing. <laughs> nothing. You said, I got nothing. I got nothing. <laughs> nothing. Okay, since nothing. you asked the guys, since you asked the guys, I'm going to ask the ladies, what is your favorite position? No. What is your favorite position and why? I do you like a woman to dominate? Depends. As long as it's not that dominatrix shit, because I don't do that being tied up like this, like being crucified. I mean, or, you know, I don't mean like that, but like take charge a little bit. Oh yeah, it's cool. It's magnificent to me. Shows that you know I don't, you know, it's equal. Shows that it's not just dominant on my side. You know? <laughs> Some people like that rough ass shit. I don't like that little ball gag and they like they put the ball gag in people's mouth and being head um, handcuffed and tied to the bedpost and all this is that I can't do shit like that because I He don't likes know, it point blank. I don't know if you're gonna slice my little my children off. I don't know if you're gonna slice my dangling off. I don't know if you're gonna slit my throat. I don't know it's like you just don't know what people think right. That's how some people kill people now. They do it with flatter first. Mm -hmm. They do it with ease, like they love you, but then next thing you know it's just like I got you right where I want you, and bam, you're dead. You're on a hundred ways to die. You're whipped. Ain't that that show, a hundred ways or a thousand ways to die? It's like most of them end up on that show. Yeah, most of them I end think up on so. That. Yeah, they end up on that. But while we're doing this, hell, we might as well give our shout outs to people too. We ain't give a shout out to people in a long time. Oh, I think you'll go first because I gotta let my shit up. <laughs> Indeed, shout out to my Facebookers. Love y'all. My real friends, of course. My feed family. Feed. Yes, feed. feed. Love my feed. What we do? What we do? People out on Tumblr. Yes, indeed. And uh, that's pretty much it. Pretty much it. First of all, I want to give a shout out to G O D, G O D, G O D, G O D. Give a shout out to God because about. You know him believing in me and you know this weird outcast guy that just seems like a nutcase and he still has me here on this world it means I have some type of purpose in this life so I always thank God every day I wake up even though I probably don't seem that way I'm not ain't gonna lie to you guys I don't attend church I don't it's a personal I it's to. a personal belief now we're going from a whole different topic right now 
we're gonna go back to sex education. Now it's about beliefs and all that. But I, I don't, I don't personally attend church because I feel like some people enforce too much belief on one person, which actually turns the saints into sinners and the sinners to non-believers. So it's like most they don't really know what to believe because you're forcing too much on them, especially when you're a kid. You don't really know what to do. It's hard for you to accept to be like, oh, if you don't do this, Jesus Christ is not going to accept you and all this, isn't it? Mm -hmm. If that's the case, Jesus Christ, uh, Jesus Christ wouldn't have died for me if that's the case. Mm -hmm. He wouldn't have died for any of us if that's the case. One thing I can't stand is one of those church-ass people that go to church and try to put their opinions on people because that's their life. Everybody has a different life out here. You could be the most Christian person, but that don't mean you a sinner at the same time. It's a false, it's a cover-up. You're a fraud. You you're in this fake. flesh, you're a sinner. Pretty right. Much. Mm. But, I don't ever force anybody to my beliefs, ever. Right. It's not, it's not going to go well. It's, it's, that's all I wanted to speak on about that. Give a shout out to my mom, my angel, my my lady, Evelyn, Eve, Barry Ankles, their old name on here. Eve. I'm going to say a middle name. So that if I would say the middle name, it would have been the whole name. Mama Barry. Eve, Mama Barry. Ms. Mama Eve. Barry. Alvin Leroy Barry Senior. <laughs> Alvin Leroy Barry Senior. That's Thank Lord. You. Puff. Puff Daddy. The original Puff Daddy. Big Puff. Yes. The original Puff. Puff Daddy. That's that's Big Puff. Shout out to my siblings. Shout out to my oldest brother Mike, aka Booty. Shout out uh, to our brother Ty. Rest in peace. We love you, Earl Ty Crawley. We love you. Always representing for you to the day we die. Shout out to my siblings, Dee Dee, Stasha Spawn, Barry. Yes, indeed. Had to do all the name in her life, every single name, and uh. Shout out to my sister, Derma. Shout out to all of my lost ones, my aunt I never met before, Angeline. Shout out to my cousin Willie, aka Lil Willie. Love you, rest in peace. Shout out to my baby. Shout out to uh, my nieces and my nephew, Shaquaya, my oldest niece, um, T. Andre, Kiki, and Tamaya. I love them to death, they're my heart. Uh, shout out to my whole family for real, and uh, even if I'm not really associated with, shout out to you because. Huh? And don't get a little Oreo. Yeah, shout out to Oreo. She's part of the Oreo. family more than anybody. Oreo. Shout out to my baby, my baby. That, that Oreo is something else. Shout out to everybody that's doing their thing out here. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to uh, my cousin Rob, aka Kobe. You know that's that's my homeboy. We grew up together. You know what I'm saying? We both had a lot of uh, things, wrong things that happened in our life, and we both turned it around and made something positive about ourselves. Congratulations on your newborn baby, you and your your uh, girlfriend. You know, shouts out to you forming a family. That's what's up, man. And um, oh, shout, shout out, out to our family, Yeah, our family. Richard. Yeah, 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 man. Shout out to uh, Alicia and Richard. And Richard, you know, they like it's like we we known them for years, and they just so cool and. To all you know, that they family, welcomed us we love y'all. All of them, like every single one in that place. Like we they, feel like family, and all the time oh, when we walk up in there, they just embrace us. They give the most, you know, heartfelt hugs that you ever feel in your life. As soon as you and come in, in the doors, you walk in, they you know what I'm saying? Shout out to y'all. Love shout you guys. Shout out to y'all. We love you. Um, shout out to my best friends, Nicole and Mook. Shout out to them. I've known them for over 14 plus years, and they've been there for me. Through thick and thin and shout out to them we probably don't hang out with each other all the time but you know i find it so ironic that i hang out with a lot of people more than i hang out with my best friends but things work out that way you know what i'm saying just mm -hmm. with anytime we do get together we make up for any like five months can easily be just taken over by two hours two hours to us all together would feel like two years so it's like you're making up for all the lost time shout out to y'all i love y'all to death Shout out to my best friend, Clifton Urell Price. Love you to death. Oh, fuck, turd. <laughs> and my other best friend, Gabby. I love you so much. Wish you was here right now. Oh, why'd you have to move? I love you, but why'd you have to move? But I love you anyway. So much is. And um, shout out to my cousin, my fave cousin. Actually, I got three favorite cousins. Already shout out Willie. That was my main road dog. You know what I'm saying? Like he taught me a lot. 
about life and growing up and how to be a man and how to survive out here. And I wish he was here with me. He would have loved what I grew up to be. And um, shout out to Mika. Shout out to Mika. That's like, she's my road dog too. Like, I'm always, we always going to be like that, you know. Indeed, and, um, Mika. Shout out to Jerome Crazy Bone Crawler, you know what I'm saying? That's motherfucking nigga. You know? Wait a minute, hold up. Shout out to the um, Ashleys. Uh, shout out to both of them. Oh, both Ashleys. of the Ashleys. Don't forget about the, don't forget about the Ashleys Peace. now. Love y'all. Peace. We love y'all. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. Shout he don't be on Facebook, but shout out to my cousin Tay. I love him to death. Yeah, That's Tay, my, my little man. Hey, Tay. What's Tay. up, dude? We love you. Yeah, shout out to everybody. And my yeah. mommy, I love my mommy so much. That's that's my rock. I love that woman. You <laughs> love my mommy. I don't, I don't know what I do without her. I'm not gonna say her name, but we didn't forget about our Cordoba luncheon. Don't we? Didn't no, we about didn't it. forget. We didn't forget. We know you're resting right now, but yeah, we didn't it will about happen. Luncheon. And to happen. Giselle and Tay, we gonna All have it with them. Yeah. All of them. No. Um, I think I named every, everybody, you know. Uh, I'm blank. Shout out to anybody that don't believe in me, too. Because, <laughs> shout out you know, to the those, haters. Those are the no, people that, the you know, shout out to them because, you know, what I realized growing up is that they have opinions, but without a fact. They won't have a purpose because opinions are focused on the fact, which makes opinions our bitch. It makes opinions our bitch because mm -hmm. opinions always are going to be focused on the fact and exactly. they're not focused on themselves. So, shout out to you and for making me just wake up every morning and just look at myself and be like, Darn, how good. You look great. You have goals. You're going to do what you want to do. You Put your mind to it. Execute it. Perfect it. Be determined. Be oh. motivated. You're going to make it. Oh, and shout out to our Misfit fam. Shout out to the Misfit fam. Wait a minute. Damn. Crystal, <laughs> aka motherfucking Styles, you know that's my road dog. Indeed, you know Styles. Saying? We got that together. We came up with this concept to get this together. You know what I'm saying? The Lord's he tattoo. You know, Morgan brothers, Morgan, aka Derek. Mo, Derry, aka D. All of them. You know what I'm saying? Love y'all. Shout out to y'all. We love y'all. And uh, I think we we was talking about sex, but I think we pretty much covered this. I mean. Indeed, if you have a preferred position or Not something anything particular, name, you know, talk about it. No, no, it's gonna be posted on Facebook and what YouTube. It's gonna be on YouTube. Facebook feed, feed, uh, YouTube, all of it. It's gonna be posted everywhere. But uh, Give we just wanted to make this video. You know what I'm saying? Shout out. You know, come talk to us. That's why we made the account, especially to our feed, our feed family. We made the account. Subscribers, so we love y'all. Much, much love to y'all. We love Feed. Like, that's like probably our most favorite, favorite, favorite site. It's just so many artistic views on there. We really appreciate y'all. It's man. never a dull moment. I love y'all artistic Thank y'all for liking and everything I do. And thank y'all for being so creative and posting stuff on there. Because I like going through the hashtags and seeing what y'all post on there. You know, uh, what you're doing in your daily life. What type of art form you're in. You know, because I try to venture into every art form that in my life and if I see something that I don't like of course I'm gonna be like okay oh, I like this there's know, it's, it's cool. it's musicians so many, so many. musicians uh, models artists so many uh, too many in the name but love y'all much love to y'all thank you for showing y'all love we thank you for subscribing to us and we definitely will return the favor and um See, I'm blowing my O. <laughs> <laughs> I had to kill oh. it. Before I but, hey, that's about it. I think we should.